YouTube, this is a continuation of the meat experiment in which I am trying different dry yeasts to create mead with. In this case, it is Safe Brew WB06. The formula is a standard formula, or I should say recipe, is a standard recipe using one gallon of the old cheap old spring water from the grocery store. Four pounds of clover honey from same grocery store. One orange, long story, but one orange. And let's see, that's about it. There is no yeast nutrient, there's no yeast starter, nothing along that line. At the taping of this video, we are nearing the 4th of July. This is the United States. The 4th of July is a celebration in which fireworks are used extensively. And some people just can't wait. And that we'll be hearing in the background. So, please ignore. Where was I? Oh, yes. There is no yeast starter. There is no yeast nutrient. And at the end of the fermentation time, the, the brewing time, if need be, bentonite is used, but that's it. The fermentation time is also at a standard. It is one month in its primary, two months in its secondary. And we shall see what we see. Now, as I am pouring this, hmm, interesting. As I am pouring this, the starting ABV is 12, starting sugar is 23, and starting gravity is 94. Ending ABV is 4, giving an overall ABV of 8% alcohol by volume. Sugar is 8, gravity is 30. This did not require any bentonite at the end. And yeah, look at that. Still a little bubbly after all this time. It is a dark yellow. Almost champagne-like. Almost. According to my notes, when I bottled this, the look is a lemonade yellow with a touch of fog. No tearing up on the side of the glass. Water consistency. I see no fog, so it cleared up in time. But it is still a little bubbly, which means there's a continuation of fermentation after the bottling. So keep that in mind if you plan on ever using this particular yeast in your mead. That it will need something to stop the continuation. Or, if you're into uh, sparkling mead, this is a good one. And that all you got to do is add in uh, some um, sugar into it, sugar pellets, to go and bottle, um, ferment the whole thing, bottle, um, yeah, you guys know what I'm talking about. The smell is a lemon orange, faint wine, faint overall, and a faint honey. I get no scent. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. I usually have a bad sniffer to begin with, but not a thing. Taste. Perfectly tart, and I underlined it for some reason. Candy lemon drops with honey, hints of orange. All right. Hmm. Yes. There is a tartness in it. Um with a bit of dry, as if it was uh, a dry wine. 
Hmm. Hints of orange, hints of honey. That honey uh, candy that you find in most in, in many meads. But there is a tartness. Yeah, perfectly tart. I have to agree with that. Um, but I think this would be really nice if it was bottle carbonated and then refrigerated before you drank it. So give it time to bottle carbonate. And right before you drink, well, right before you drink, fridge it for 24 hours, it would be really good. I have here um, other notes, overall notes. Perhaps perfect for summer with ice. We'll need help to clear. Second fermenter looks better than in the glass. Be warned of this deception. Interesting. Because it is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Which is rather contradictory, considering that um, if it's still fermenting, I would have felt that it would not have cleared. And obviously it's still fermenting partially because, hell, it's still bubbling. It just has to look at it. So one would have, would have thought there should have been a fog. And there is none. It is, it is beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. But that tartness makes it taste as if it's a little bit raw. Now, with that in mind, this was bottled on 1.18.16. The taping of this video is 6. Uh, 25, something like that, 16. So it had about five months in the bottle, the old bottle, with the old swing top on it to make sure nothing happens too badly. And it cleared, but did not finish its fermentation. Oh well. So once again, this is Safe Brew WB16, uh, ending ABV of 8%, and given time, it clears up nicely. It would be, make a nice summer uh, show meat, which this is. Give it a try, see what you think. In the meantime... That's how to end this. Uh, in the meantime, keep on brewing.